hello friends uh, welcome again and uh, this is my new project online shopping system and i have developed this project in java spring boot uh, database i am using the mysql and uh, uh, front end i am using angular right so for database on the uh, spring boot site i am using jpa and hibernate and uh, uh, i am using the sts spring boot tool suits for developing microservices in spring boot right and the job for writing the java codes and for uh, angular site i'm using the visual studio code for writing uh, angular codes right and i'm running the angular application on port 4200 and java application we are using tomcat server so the port is 8080 so for design the front end i'm using html css and javascript right also this is a partial bootstrap thing means it's a partial responsive it it is not 100 percent responsive but yes responsive is there right so these all technology stacks i have used for developing this project and the project title is online shopping systems so let's start with the functionality go through that what the functionalities are available inside the project and what we have implemented the first of the first thing this is a major project which has customer as well as admin panel right so i will show you the customer panel first later on i will show you the admin panel so once you run this project on port 4200 then you will get this home page so you can see this is a home page right these all categories are coming from the database right and these above informations and banners are static this is about page and this is a static page there is nothing dynamic on it this is all categories and these all categories are coming from the database if you click on the categories then you will be able to see all of the product which belongs to that category right so you can see right if you click on the details then you will be able to see the details and after that you can post the comment also right but you can post the comment only and only if you have login i will show you after the login right <clears throat> okay so this is add to cart option but you can't add the item into the cart without login so there is a restrictions there so this is all category this is all product here you can see search operation from here you can search the product right if i am writing the product if i click on the search then it will search suppose if i am having product number seven so you can see search is working right so you can search even if you want to see the toy then it will search all categories which belong to that category right so this is all products this is a login so there are two types of login here this is a customer login and admin login there is a separate ui for that this is a registration if you don't have user id and password then you can register from here and you can create your own this is a contact us and this is a dynamic contact us if you fill this form then all of the details will be saved inside the database and you can see it on backend panel means on admin panels this is a feedback of the website from here you can write the feedback and after that those feedback will be displayed on the backend panel right on admin panel now i am going to log in as a customer so the current user id is amit at the gmail.com and password is test once you log in then you will get this customer dashboard so this is a customer dashboard right here you can see a lot of operations right so now i am going to buy some of the products so i am going to buy this product details add to cart you can see that items has been added into the cart now clicking on add products and now i am going to buy this so <laughs> g-shop watch add to cart you can see both item has been added into the cart now i am going to add this toy add to cart so three items added into the cart but if you feel if you want to delete anyone just click on the delete button that item will be deleted from the cart right even i, I was showing you the comment section so once you click here then you can see this is a comment section but if you new comment and so this is this product is very good product very good product right so this is very good product 
right once you click on the submit comment then you can see the comment has been posted right and comment is by amit kumar on 12th of march this is a very good product right so okay so this comment is working you can see the review right here right now if you click on the my cart you will be able to see all of the items which you have added into your cart if you click on the continue shopping then you will be redirected to the product page right so now i am going to check out so here it's asking for the credit card details so this is a dummy page i am not making any type of real transactions this there is no payment gateway so you can enter anything here right so anything you can enter here you can set a card year month and total amount you can't oh, sorry i think so i need to yes total amount so here you can enter the name card type this and make payment once you click on the make payment your order id will be generated you can see this is the order id 275 and the order date customer name contact number right each and everything is here right and this is the details so you can see your cart is empty now because you have made the payment for all of the cart items once you click on the my orders then you will be able to see all of the orders this is your last order which you have made today once you click on this arrow icon you will be able to see the details of your order right so this is a my account section from here you can update your account details and log out so this is a session driven menu if you click on the logout then this menu will not be rendered right it means my administration my cart and you will not be able to buy any of the products so you can see those Admin, administration menu has gone now i am going to log in as an admin you can see this is a, a new ad panel so admin and password is test once you log inside the system then you can see this is a admin dashboard right so once you click on the company management you will be able to see all of the companies here right this is a product management you will be able to see all of the products which you have added if you want to add a new product then you will be able to see all of the details here right this is a company this is a category management all of the category will be displayed here add new category you can see category is showing here right this is all orders you will be able to see all of the orders right you can see all of the orders are here this is a customer management all of the customers which have registered will be displayed here you even you can add new customer this is a contact us support all of the customer who has submitted the contact us will be displayed here this is the feedback report all of the customer who has submitted the feedback will be displayed here and the logout right so once you click on the dashboard you can jump on the page clicking on this menu also and once you click on the logout then you will be reacted to the login page right so these all functionalities i have developed inside this project online shopping system as i told you earlier this is a java spring boot angular and mysql based project and if you need more functionality if you need more enhancement in this project just put it into the comments i will incorporate those changes i will make this project more better and better according to your requirements and don't forget to subscribe our channel for getting the latest project videos on the latest technologies thanks for watching the video thank you very much